Hi, and welcome back to a new tutorial. Today we will be talking about how to configure glass. Uh, you're going to see it's actually very easy to do. However, you need to know a few tips and tricks. So make sure to stay till the end to really get the full picture. So right now you can see here, I have a glass door that I want to set up. What you need to do first is to open the Enscape material editor and select obviously your substrate. The first thing that you need to do when you set up your glass is that you need to go in albedo color and you need to set that to black. So why black? Because black is actually the physically correct color for glass. So let's start off by selecting here and you can see right now that our glass window or soon to be glass window is now set to black. Then we need to make sure to decrease the roughness to 2%. The roughness, uh, this actually sets how glossy the material will be. In this case, we're going to be very close to the glass kind of look and feel. We then need to move on to what we call the spe specular. So specular here, we're going to set that up to 100%. This actually controls the strength of the reflection. So make sure to set that up at 100%. And finally, here in transparency, we need to set that up to transmittance. And once you've set it up in transmittance, what you need to make sure is to set up the opacity to roughly minus 10%. Now, setting up the opacity pretty much means this actually sets how transparent your material will be. So for example, if I set it up at 100%, you can see that it's opaque. Well, if we move it down to roughly, you know, 5% or so, you can see that now it's completely transparent. And there we go. Right now you have a nice glass window. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe and stay tuned because videos will be released on a weekly basis with heaps of content and new tutorials for you to learn how to improve with Enscape.